Oh, no, 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 no. Get, get him away from that. <laughs> Look at the little hats. He's like, uh, listen, boss, uh, I think we ought to do it. Uh-oh, in we go. Here we go again. Mario's like, I've been a retired plumber for 20 years. I'm gonna charge my phone. No, don't do that. Everyone, get away. Get away from it. Grab a peach. Grab... Oh. And they're gone. Hey, at least you guys can take a break now. Not your problem. Somewhere in another dimension. It's a much nicer dimension. Money, 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 money. <laughs> Where is he? Where's my boy? Oh no, where's the rest of the washing machine? Where are we? Maroons, on a tropical island with no means of warping back? We have to reassemble. This is just the plot to Toe Jam and Earl. Damn kids and their technology. This is your fault, Rabbit Peach. I don't even think you're gonna get any service here in another dimension. Oh, they all got little coconut guns. The boy! He's here! Like, uh oh, I know this guy. Yo, he just yeeted somebody. Donkey Kong, ground pounding primate. Donkey Kong's looking a little slim in this game. You lose weight? Get a haircut? Rabid Cranky Kong. All right, come on, speed it up a little bit. Does he have like a crossbow? That thing opened up. You saw that, right? Oh, here you go. Here's your shark gun. Maybe don't point it at your face. We're just getting right into the damn thing. I am really excited for this. I enjoyed this game, and I know I'm gonna enjoy this DLC. Why? Because it's Donkey Kong. Anything DK is for me. I'm gonna grab this thing, because apparently we can throw it. Oh, look at this. Can we hit everybody? Almost. Grab that, shrink it down a little bit. Boom! All right, I'm gonna use Hairy Eye. I'm, just, I'm using everything at my disposal right now. And I'm gonna throw this banana rang. Oh, it hits multiple enemies. That's sick. I just, I'm just i doing such little damage, and I'm not used to it, because we're doing massive damage at the end of the story. Oh, that's a frail old man. Don't throw him. Cranky Kong came strapped. All right, stink eye. So as soon as you move, DK and Cranky are going to light you up. So cool. All right, let's head that way. He's like, no, that way. Into the barrel cannon so we can get to the main island and collect all the parts so we can all go home. Wait, he's gonna use it as a unicycle? Look how fast he is now. Oh, of course, he's gonna lead the pack. All right, hang on. We have uh, at 650 bones. Let's head to the Battle HQ and see if we can get anything. Oh, this one's a pepper. The habanero caballero. I'm gonna go with the pepper gun. And I guess we have runes here instead of uh, orbs. Oh, wait a second. I can grab enemies out of the ground if their ears... Okay, taking that. All right, what is this on the ground? Oh, it's a part for the washing machine. It just, it looks... I was gonna say, don't touch that. You'll probably get electrocuted. These scavengers. Hey, give that back. It's like, no, mine. The Collector, Compulsive Curator. So I have heard from multiple people that this DLC can get pretty hard, but I feel like we've gotten pretty good at this game. So those are either gonna be my famous last words or we're just gonna breeze through. There's a skull, will that kill him? Let's see, I think I'm gonna rip him out of the ground and toss him. Nice, and then we can light him up. Let's make everyone go sleepy. Everyone do nappy, night, night. They call it the classic, but we call it the Banana Slamma. Banana Slamma! Keep running. Your fate will all be the same. I get this back right now. I mean, they're really just running. They're not attacking anybody. Just being a pain in the ass. There we go. Oh, right into it. So we have Peach in there to pick this one up. I like it. The missions are a little different. It's not just like killer escort. Oh, look at the trophy. It's a golden barrel with a bunch of bananas. Uh-oh, do we have to fight rabid DK? He's like an imposter, but it is you who's the imposter. He's having war flashbacks. You know what's messed up if- Oh, wow. This is a straight up anime scene now. Is she dead? So if Rabbit Peach wasn't here, then uh, this this would be fine. Everything would be okay, right? They could maybe be friends. They'd be like, hey, we have the same tie. Wow, he's not even phased. Uh-oh. Yep, that was definitely a defeat all cutscene. Peach is pissed. Check out those fascinating surface formations. They have your name on it. By hopping on them, you'll be able to leap forward at even greater distances. 
to just kick her ramps. Let's do this. Does she start at 40 because she just got pummeled? That's not fair. Fire in the hole! Oh, that's right. He has vamp. So that's how Cranky manages to stay young. He just siphons the life out of other creatures. Get throw the hot pepper, because we're spicy boys. Yo, hold up, hold up! Man, I am actually really, really excited for Sparks of Hope. I have something really cool in the works that I'm not allowed to talk about, but I promise by the time this series is ended and before that game comes out, you'll know all about it. I love the shotgun he has. Don't, no, don't come over here. I'm just gonna play keep away. I'll shoot him, he's gonna come over here now. Oh, we stuck him. Too sleepy. Go night-night. <laughs> Look at him taking a nap. He's just laying on the pile of honey. Speaking of honey, have you guys seen that trailer for the horror movie that's coming out? The Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Hunt? I didn't want to talk about it. It's so frightening to me. Like, I know Winnie the Pooh is public domain, but do we really need this? Is this really something that the world needs? It's my favorite Disney character. Why must you do this? Creative minds in general have been taking a lot of liberties with public domain stuff lately. Like, there's a new Souls-like Pinocchio game coming out, which I'm not gonna lie, it looks kind of rad. I might play it. It's like a steampunk Pinocchio Souls-like, and it actually does look kind of dope. For anyone wondering, it's called Lies of P, if you want to look it up. She's like, oh, my dress is all fil- Oh, okay. Who needs the washing machine then? Rabbit Kong is a beast. He's got to be the final boss, right? It makes sense for this story. He's like, hey, um, told you not to, not to touch that. Oh, it's one of them newfangled futuristic bananas. Damn it, I told you to buy the ones without the GMOs. Uh, do so you just have psychic abilities now? I've eaten a lot of bananas in my day. None of them have made me do that. Most of them just make me poop. Oh, it looks like the main core of the uh, washing machine is right in Rabid Kong's hideout, like right in the middle. What a coincidence. And the gate is guarded. And you need two keys? They really thought this one out. Destroy bad bananas? Oh, we just gotta get over there. All right, no, no problem. They look like they got molds growing on it. Okay, that's a lot of piles. Boom! Get cranky move. Oh, wow, that's right. He has the AOE uh, team jump. Boom! So sick. Stink eye. He's like, back in my day, bananas cost a nickel. And also, let me get that soul. Uh-uh. Back off. Oh, I can throw him. That's not what I wanted to do, but I'll do it. Because it's funny. Hit him with the old banana slammer. And destroy those nanners. And you know what? Take a nap. Go sleep. You got ice on your head. It's like laying your head down on a cold pillow. Is there really a better feeling? Going to sleep, especially on like a hot summer night. And you get a nice cold pillow. And the room is cold. Yeah, blow it up. And then we have Cranky Kong just like with the sawed off shotgun. Just like, say your prayers. This is taking too long. I'm gonna do this. Maybe we could just stick him. You leave me alone. I'm busy. This has so much health. No worries. We'll just mash down B. All right, put this one to bed. Uh, hello. It's not doing as much damage. And then I'm also realizing it's because I don't have like a lot of health, but it's probably on par. There we go. Get away from me. That should be all the bananas. So I think we're done, right? Thank you. So that was fun and different, doing the uh, the bad banana mission. Better be something cool in here. I'm about to buy some stuff. Ah, music. A key. Now don't eat those bananas. They're bad. Look at this big man eating his bananas with a fork and knife. It's like exquisite. Get away from my banana. Not a single bite. And are we fighting a mid-boss now? That's a cool-ass weapon. I guess he's not gonna finish those. Oh, you're in trouble now, sir. Hey, you better run. Side eye. Stand off, fish. Get it? No. Is he just gonna run the whole time? Bam! What are you going to do? I'm curious. Oh my god. Holy crap. I was not expecting that. That nah, thing's done. You know what? I'm gonna just refrain from moving because he's glowing. I don't know how much that's gonna hurt. 
wait for it to wear out. And there's only 25. Uh, I probably could have endured it for that turn. Poor Cranky, though. Cranky's getting lit up. All right, a lot happening. We gotta kill the mid-boss. Fortunately, we have this. And he's powered up again. I should have saved the sentry. Okay, I really need to focus on taking out some of these. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Okay, I, I see. I see that I have I have misspoken. I should have taken out some of the, the lesser enemies. We're gonna be relying on Donkey Kong. All right, it's working. Okay, this is still salvageable. He has 190 health. I know we're not dealing like crazy numbers here, but we can do it. It's these other dudes that are gonna mess me up though. I underestimated them. I was like, everyone's dealing a little bit of damage. The numbers are low, we'll be fine. And of course he would spawn right now, right there. Jesus. Still alive though. I mean, the good thing is everyone is on the other side of the map, so I can kind of like run. Oh crap! The thing that sucks is like, I'm gonna get him down pretty low. I can risk it all and I I'm willing to. DK just enduring, endure. I have 10 health. I don't think I can do it. I can get real close. He's out of range. I really should just reset. There's one attack and I'm dead, but we'll let him finish it off. Give him the satisfaction. Get out of here, Cranky. Okay, okay. Maybe it's a little bit difficult. Just, just a little bit. All right, I'm gonna send you out. Try and distract some of these guys. I got it this time. That, that was a really good first turn. We quartered his health. I think I just gotta do it before uh, all the other ones start spawning. And then we're outnumbered. All right, that's good. We got that out of the way. Nah, -uh, you ain't running from me. Wait, I can pick this thing up? I can just like launch the sentry? Why did nobody tell me that? Come here, little buddy. I'm gonna make you useful. Then, oh, he's just out of range. I can make him go to sleep though. This is the turn. So if he's asleep, does he miss his turn? Because the sentry hitting him would be huge. Go the other way! Response, why don't you ask me later? It's fine, I don't care. That was a really satisfying crack. Bam, just hit him from all angles. Why, why is Donkey Kong turning around? Why is he showing him his ass while he... What is he, a baboon? I am inevitable. He can't go anywhere. Stupid. All right, he's gonna take the hit. I was expecting that. Gotta get in range. Oh, crap. On a cracker. Look at him spicy pepper. Put the spicy pepper right in the butt. He's 50 health. We're gonna do this. It's gonna happen this time. Break down the barriers. You got nowhere to hide. All right, the bodies are falling. It's okay, we have DK. Oh, I can take him out on this turn. He's done. Watch this. Good night. Give me that key. Oh, he was just like a regular rabbit that had a key. That's just a rabbit who let his heart be his guiding key. And finally, we got some new weapons. This is a fish. You got a fish? A phone? I kind of want the bounce damage because it triggers the uh, the opportunity attack. So I'm going to go with the fish weapon, the koi ploy. All right, could you stop taking pictures? We have like one more. Oh, selfie-ish. Okay. Thought my puns were bad. There's like damn kids in their cell phones nowadays. Oh, he mad. <laughs> she knows. Um, oh, he's horny. Oh, things are changing. Look at these pipes now. Stop the smugglers. What are they smuggling exactly? Banana loving bootleggers. Are they just not gonna attack me? Do they have one mission and it's just bring bananas from A to B? There's four smugglers. I assume they gotta be able to move kind of slow because look how close they are already. Uh, I'm gonna use that. It's not gonna move from it, but I feel better knowing that when he does move, we're gonna bust a cap. Look at this rabbit. He's like, oh crap, he's glowing. Just let my guy say banana slammer. Nintendo, you don't have to be ashamed. It's like Ryuji wanting to say yeah, as soon as he moves, he's getting shot by both of them. Oh, don't you dare. Okay, so they are smashers. Clearly. I really thought they were just gonna go for the the end and that was it. How am I supposed to stop this? Oh, I have an idea. Dude, I don't got time for you. All right, let's see. You're gonna have to start getting creative. Go through here, I can make the jump. Wow, I can really cover some distance. <laughs> Wait, I'm throwing him back. I don't care, that's fine. I'm just gonna physically remove this man. Get back there. You know what, I probably should have kept going. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to reach the other right side smuggler. You know what, I'll just, I'll have DK go to the other side. Problem solved. Imagine just getting like a fish thrown at you. All right, hold up, hold up. 
This man gotta be stopped. Get your ass back over there. DK just crushes all his bones to turn him into a ball. It's for the bin. Oh, wait, hang on. I can... Okay, he's dead. Cranky should be able to finish this dude off. You done. So I thought this one was gonna be a little tougher than it turned out to be. So it was gonna be really frustrating to have to chase them down because they were so close, but DK literally being able to pick them up and throw them back half the map is uh, pretty useful. Hit him with the old banana slam and to finish it off. All right, here we go. They don't give you a breather in between battles. Oh, it's a washing machine part battle. Buckler, much maligned hide behind. Oh, he's just he's got the shield. Here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna turn the lights off, and uh, whoever took the machine parts, I'm gonna ask that you put them back. No one's gonna get in trouble. Get fished. All right, so the grenade that I just got is good against the bucklers. I'm gonna toss that. Wow, that is uh, some good damage. I have a melon. Everyone's on the wrong side of the map. What are you doing? Where are you going? Took the longest route possible to get there. All right, let's do this. If I pick him up, does that count as moving? I'm right there. That doesn't count. All right, give me that part back. Yeah, this fish here probably stinks by now. DK's been carrying it around in the hot sun for hours. Thing has not been refrigerated. That's what's dealing the damage. Nose damage. You can't escape my toys. All right, here's the piece. Taking this. We might actually kill him too. Because bounce damage plus the damage that's gonna... Yeah, he did. Wait, is that all of them? There's one more, I think. There's three parts. Oh, here he is. You st Oh my god, he's got all of them now. Cranky, uh, keep the big guy busy for me for a second. We need DK's mobility. A satisfying crunch. Those parts of mine, you young whippersnapper. Back in my day, we worked. Now give him back. Oh, sorry, DK. Oh, no, you don't. Ow. Ow! I'll just, I'm gonna get these and I'm gonna go. One, two, three. And for good measure, Taking you over here, and I'm throwing you in the ocean. <laughs> it was worth it. Oh my god, no! All right, Cranky, do me a favor, real quick. Okay, all right, no more messing around. For real now. Let's get all the parts and let's win. <sighs> okay, but it was funny. All right, we gotta be getting close to that second key now. When did it start raining, by the way? Like, I know uh, you get thunderstorms in tropical areas every now and then, but it should be passing. The weather should, who is this? A shark? He's wearing the skin of a shark, which is actually kind of horrifying. Finn. One shark feeding frenzy. He's got like a pet octopus or something. Dude, that's a cool weapon. That octopus is just chilling. Well, this... Uh... Probably a bad idea to be hiding behind that. There we go. The good news is they're together. I can take care of some of the goons. Hmm. We're just ripping through. I'm afraid of what he can do, though. 600 health? I mean, that's a lot. He's got a lot of movement. Oh, my God. Yikes. Oh, it makes sense that he is able to ink people because he has the octopus on top. You guys ever have squid ink pasta? That is some good stuff, let me tell you. Back off. We, we just put him in the corner. It's like, Finn, you go in the corner and you think about what you've done. Uh, I feel like I shouldn't move. Because I don't want to know what that op Oh, wait, hang on. That, that works. That works. Oh, no. Come a little bit closer. So I want to use my mid-boss sauce on you. You think it's like a hot sauce or something? Deals extra damage to him. No, no stay on the other side of that block. Stay over. Oh, God. He's, why is he charging like that? Can I reach him from here? Yes, I can. It's going to deal like no damage, though. Oh, wait. I think we got a crit. Come on. He's an old man. He's got dementia. Go sleep. We got a free dash attack. I'm, I'm doing some damage here. We're, we're making it happen. Like the Cap'n. Isn't that one of the slogans for Captain Crunch? Or it used to be? All right, he's like half health already. All right, let's do this. Like, I feel like he's tough, but he's not really, like, 20 damage a hit? It's like nothing. Uh, I should probably shield, though. Unless he's got a second phase, but I doubt it. Yeah, we're just, we're dropping his health. <laughs> no, you can't hurt me. I have a force field up. That's like the little kid pretend rule number one. You got a force field up, you can't be hurt. Still alive. No one died. Just look at that. Too easy. Oh, he had the key all along. Look how cute the little shark is. All right, we got the second key, so we can go open the gate now. All right, we did it. Let's hop in the barrel. That should take us back to the gate. Just the way they designed this beach. It's like a resort. Got them both. All right, now we have to turn them at the same time. Otherwise, uh... No, come on. The other way. Hey, Cranky. 
Yep, yeah, thank you. <laughs> you just turn him upside down. All right, the gate is open. What lies beyond? We'll find out in the finale. We'll see you next time.